Market Day report. I'm Scott England, and we begin our news this morning in San Antonio, Texas, where beef is big business this week. The 117th Annual National Cattlemen's Beef Association Convention and Trade Show is a must-attend event for cattle producers and related industries. RFD-TV's Mike Hansen is there and has this report. We've had a lot to talk about at the 2015 Annual Meeting of the National Cattlemen's Beef Association, and in the spirit of things here, I like to concentrate a lot on animal health. I mean, we got cattlemen coming in some challenging years, and Bill Sirico with Animal Health International, um, a good friend of ours, so Bill, uh, you help everybody get over the hump on a lot of things when it's changing conditions or new approaches. Uh, love the word innovation, but also at a time when companies combine, and you seem to be one of those good calming forces for that. Well, uh, thank you for saying that, Mike, and we like to think we are as well. Uh, we've worked with, uh, specifically with Alonco, we have a very long history with Alonco, and they've always been uh, a great partner of ours. They help educate our customers, help educate our um, sales reps, who are then able to bring that information to the customer down the field, both producers and veterinarians. And we're certain that we have an even stronger partner in Alonco now that they've broadened their portfolio and bring even more innovative products to the marketplace. Okay, I'm going to talk just a little bit with Matt Hill. Uh, Matt with Alanco, and this is a combination of Alanco and Novartis. Uh, a larger product line for one guy to get tested on here, but I don't want to go there. Sure. But uh, uh, th those favorite products are still there, but it means a lot working with these guys because that's a good, that's a good funnel of information. Absolutely, the partnership we have with Animal Health International is a critical one for, for our customers, for, for cattle producers in the industry to, to take technologies and get them in the hands of producers. And so that partnership with Animal Health International uh, certainly helps to do that and get innovative technologies to cattle producers. Well, that's a constant flow of conversation when you have so many products and, and you have to have so much knowledge over uh, different beef operations. That's quite a challenge for you and Animal Health International to continue to talk. Absolutely. I think that, that partnership is critical to help customers understand what products they're using and where they fit within their operations. And certainly uh, hearing the same information both from Alanco and Animal Health International representatives is a critical piece to help the customer understand what products to use and where to use them. All right. Thank you very much. Well, there you have it this time at the National Cattlemen's Association Annual Convention 2015. I'm Mike Hanson. The National Cattlemen's Beef Association's Convention and Expo runs through Saturday in San Antonio, Texas. We'll have more coverage from the convention in our next half hour. For more information, visit our website, rfdtv.com forward slash links. We have some breaking news.